I call Ratchet. I'm in Scabs, mother. Hi! Sorry it took so long. I had to, you know, talk to a few people and I am free now. I have I need advice. I did talk to Twinkles about the thing, but I need to tell you now. Because like I feel like you would know more th than anybody about relationship advice, right? Yeah, I slept with multiple men. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And women. Perfect. Okay. So I'm well, I'm, te I'm teaching Tessa and Ember how to do some rat strat jumps so they can get away from cops. And she just oh. did a perfect uh, thing. Yeah, you could join us if you want. Well, I don't I don't have a whole lot of time. I got to go searching for a ring. Oh, okay. You, you trying to get married? Well, so, okay. That's what I wanted to talk to you about. But it seems like you're busy. So I'll talk to you another time about it. I feel like that was an escape boat not to talk about it, mother. I'm free right now. No, I don't. But they can't know. I've I've told a couple people already, and I realize I'm telling too many people, and it's not going to be a surprise anymore. Okay. Um, I, I will you? get out of the car, and we can have a conversation, because this is some mother tea I am trying to sip. Okay. Well, I'll wait for you to get out of the car. Okay. I got out of the car. Listen, ah! Are you okay? Yeah, I jumped out of the car. Okay. Are you guys keep hey, you guys keep practicing? I got to talk on the phone, right? Mm-mm-mm. Good, good, good. All right, now, now, now I'm free. All right, listen. I told Twinkles, I told Kitty, and now you're the third person I'm telling you, the last person I'm telling you, okay? Because why would you really... tell a cat? Kitty? Yeah, why would you tell a cat, motherfucker? Well, actually, that's pretty good you tell a cat because it can't no, speak English. No, not a, a literal cat. Well, I mean, she has Kitty, but, like, not like a furry cat, like a human cat, like girl. She's one of my best friends, but she's also best friends with my ex-best friend. So it's a little awkward right now. And I probably oh, should have told her. But like, this is Kitty. like, I'm testing her trust. Like, my trust with her. I'm testing her. Yeah. No, Kitty. Kitty, the one yeah, that's the one married that, that, and that, stuff. That, that, that mm -hmm. dating the dude from uh, Disney Channel. Yes, yes. Goofy. That's right. Yeah, Goofy. Mother yeah, mm -hmm. that guy. That's the one. Okay, listen. Okay. All right. I have to ask you because I feel like you have some really good advice for me. And you would be real with me. I feel like other people might not be so real, okay? Yeah. Okay. Listen. You're, oh, you weren't at the meeting. Okay. Which one? Uh, oh, the meeting before the second meeting, the one that you hosted. Oh, um, yeah, I wasn't it was, there. It was the other meeting that Kirk hosted, but Chatty, like, pretty much, like, got on his knee before me and was like, while well, everyone's watching, and I, you know, I was like, it made me think that he was proposing, but then he asked if he had a booger on his head, and there wasn't even a booger there. And so I was thinking, like, whoa, you know what? I should propose to him in front of everybody. That way, you know, he can't say no. And so I've been telling him I'm looking for this ring because it's like a dream I had. And I realized like, oh my God, I think I'm looking for a ring because I should propose to him. Like, doesn't that make sense? Like, I should actually propose to him. And I'm thinking that's why I need to go to get a tarot card reading again by Winsong and see if this prophecy is true because it was a dream I had. But maybe it's like actually why I've been doing it. It's because I should propose. Anyways, the reason why I want to propose is because like, I just feel like I need to lock him down. Like, I tried locking him down with, like, adopting, like, Mumbles. And, like, uh, Wendy also wants to be adopted. Like, so I want to baby trap him. And also, if we're married, that's another layer that he can't get out of, right? Yeah. Motherfucker, you adopting the wrong clowns. Well, I need to pick the right clown. Anyways, he was open to the whole Wendy thing. I was like, this is great. Like, if we get... If we have a kid, like, he can't, like, escape. And so, I'm thinking... The best way to propose to him would probably to hold him at gunpoint, have Vinny, my adoptive father, kidnap him because he wants to kidnap him because Chatty stole his license. And so uh, maybe Vinny kidnaps him. I hold him up at gunpoint and then Kitty suggested a flash mob. So it's in front of everyone that knows him. Then he can't say no, right? And then I was thinking maybe I could do it all by the ocean. So if he says no, I could just ocean dump him and do it again and again and again and again. Right? Wait. So... Hmm? No, I heard we flashing. Do, so, yeah. like, no clothes? We could do it naked if that appears like there's more peer pressure. Yeah, that really threw him off. Yeah, everybody, really you see everybody uh, pepper. Yeah. Yeah, so um, I'm just trying to figure out what would be the best way for him to not say no. Okay, so your advice that you're asking me the advice is the best way for him not to say no. Yeah. I'm going to be real with you. All right, you ready? Okay. This dumbass is madly in love with your. Yes. And yeah, I didn't mean to like, say it like that. My bad. But I want to make sure that we have a healthy relationship still. And so, like, what, you know, like, I want to make sure, like, he, you know, would love me more. Because, like, if he really loved me more, he would have proposed by now. Like, why hasn't yeah. he proposed by now? Because, like, if he actually loved me, he would have said something. But he's never had. It's been, mm. like, it's been, like, three years. Maybe maybe he's testing the water. That's why what? he kneeled down to try to see how you would do. And he said it was just a booger, motherfucker. But he was no, just trying to pick on you. He said it was a booger. And I feel like... 
that's messed up, right? He should have proposed right then and there or sooner. Mm -hmm. It's a little too late. I feel like it's been mm -hmm. way too long and he should have done it by now. No, it's time for you to step by now. You need to be, you need to make the power move. You you the, mm -hmm. you the queen. I am the queen. You know what I'm saying? And you know, know what? You I'm do? asserting my dominance, which is why I'm making mm -hmm. sure all the clowns do what I say. And um, that's just, you know, I'm, I, I'm proving that I could be the queen that he always wanted and not Sooty. Mm. Mm -hmm. Why you say not Sooty? <sighs> she makes me insecure and I feel like she'd be a better queen. I'm not going to lie, but it's okay. Don't tell anyone. You're the second person I told that. Please don't say anything. Listen, you know why Sooty couldn't be a good queen? And not to, because not she's to say not that dating Chatty. No. Because she lets things get to her too fast and too quick. Things but get what to you me. do, no, but you lay down a law though. That's a little different, you know what I'm saying? But listen, you were you were born for that shit, motherfucker. You listen, I was watching Game of Thrones. You ain't Cersei, motherfucker. You is the dragon queen. You just need to not let Jon Snow stab your ass and I just ruined the shit. I'm sorry. Those spoilers. I'm sorry, but listen, all I'm saying is, motherfucker, I bet if you take control and you kidnap Chatty huh? and torture that bitch, yeah, okay. that's the type yeah. of shit, you know, he used to do back in the day. That motherfucker used no, to torture I and know. eat people. Like, I know he, like, you know, he, uh, yeah, he ate people and he mm -hmm. was a whole different man back in the day. And, you know, mm -hmm. I, I know he, uh, he killed his wife. <gasps> you know about that? Oh, I know about that. So, you Damn. know. Oh, yeah, no, he, he's told me everything. And so I, you know... He, he's into some crazy stuff. So maybe me torturing mm -hmm. him would make him, you know, fall in love with me more. And he won't say no. I'm going I'm to be real with you. I, I, I'm thinking if you plan some crazy torturing, and not like the normal torturing type shit, you know what I'm saying? Like if you plan some crazy torture and shit, mm. I, bet, I bet that would be the way in. Because you could just be like, hey! It, yeah. Yeah. Hey, Chatty! Yeah. And then you get like some kind of chair or something, just mm. that shit at him. Okay. Like okay. WWE. Okay. Okay, so WWE. Yeah. Okay. By th Okay, so with a gun by the ocean. Okay. And well, you know there there is the torture. torture oh. Oh, oh you the torch. Well, yeah, at the house I could do it at the house with everyone there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wait, so so you, you want to torture him and then ask him? Or you could do the flash mob thing where, like, we get everybody together. <gasps> oh, my God. What if we pretend a clown died? I could pretend I died. And then, like, we're all, like, gathering, like, to say goodbye. And um, then you do it. Okay, so at your fake funeral. Yeah. And then, like, you guys, you, you asked to marry yeah. him. And then I'll get up and be like, <gasps> It's so beautiful. I came back to life, motherfucker. You gotta say yes now. She saved my life. It would be very memorable. Okay. All right. So we... So we... we, Okay, we put you in ICU. And then I propose yeah. at ICU with a gun, with Vinny, and a flash mob at your funeral in ICU. Yeah. Okay. But the issue is, like, do we want all the clowns to know? Or is this, like, a... You know, well, like, here's the thing all the clowns gonna find the f out no matter what, so it's either you do it in front of them or you do it and then they find out like three minutes later. Okay, yeah, yeah the clowns are like gossip girl, mother as soon as somebody finds out, that shit get tweeted. I know for a fact that if other people find out, it's you. What do you mean it's me? Kitty, I didn't say shit. Kitty and Twinkles aren't gonna, you're the third person, third and only person I'm telling you about this, and this is a trust bond right now. Okay, well, listen. I, I, listen, I don't tell if nobody you, secrets. If you snitch, ratchet. I would never snitch. I'm listen, gonna do there's some things. crazy shit that you don't even find sexy, all right? I'm, a, I'm going to pull your balls back around over your <gasps> neck, up and under, oh and my God. choke you with your own gooch if you snitch, okay? Oh you better Jesus relax. God. Okay, I'm sorry. Listen, I would never snit. So I've never even told people that uh, Gigi's fucking, uh, meth lab was located uh, right below the goddamn motherfucking UP. Oh, shit, I just told you. Oh. She has a meth lab? I don't think it's there. I, that's seven years later. I don't think it's there anymore. Oh, but I would never snit. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah, I swear. Okay. Yeah, well, and I don't want to be choked with my own goose, motherfucker. That shit stank. Yeah, yeah. So you better, you know, keep your lips sealed. Okay, well, it was nice talking to you, Ratchet. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm gonna well, go look for a ring. Huh? What do you think? Well, Who do you think's advice? Oh, I, I really like your advice. I, I, I Honestly, I've been putting everyone's advice together. 
Ooh, okay, like threesome. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all all three of uh, all three of your ideas, I put it all together in one big idea, and there's no that's three times the chance of him saying yes. Mm hmm. I just feel I'm like thinking, I'm thinking the death thing actually might really like ha, like you you look to your side and and somebody came back to life because of the love. Like you can't mm -hmm. say no now. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah, and it would be so memorable, and he'll be like, "Whoa, this was this was meant to happen." It could even be Kirk's fat ass too. He could like have, like we could have like pretend he died from diabetes. I don't know if he would believe that Kirk died though. True, but he might believe me. I, I think I, he'd I get believe you. Because you. you're nuts. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Okay. We'll plan things out. I gotta go look for the okay. ring. Alrighty. All right, oh, bye. Ooh, oh, oh, what happened? You can get him from a quarter machine. They got lollipops on them. Oh, like a, a one of those candy rings. That's a good one. Yeah. Oh, God damn it. Now I want one. Okay. All right. Get two. I'll get two. One for you, too. Uh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Appreciate it, motherfucker. Hey, bye. Bye, Felicia. I think I lost brain cells from that conversation. Me, too. Oh, God.